Hey everyone, and welcome back to another eShop Deals video, where each and every week we go through the Nintendo Switch eShop and we look at what are some of the best games that are currently on sale. Now, I know that the video is a day late, but yesterday was a holiday here in Canada and since it was so nice outside, I just decided to take the day off and spend it with the kids. But you know what, nonetheless that actually worked out because we got some great deal drops between yesterday and today and that's what we're going to be looking at in today's video. Now just before we jump into those deals, I do want to give a quick reminder for anyone who might be new to the channel. About halfway through the video, we're going to give away two $5 eShop gift cards. If you want to participate in that giveaway in future videos, all you need to do is be subscribed and drop a comment down below. Also, if at the end of the video you're still looking for other great deals, I'll always be linking last week's regular eShop deals as well as the latest under $5 list because most of those deals are still running today and I just don't repeat them two videos in a row. So now, just as usual, with all of that stuff out of the way, let's not waste any more time and jump straight into the deals. Do remember that one of the best ways to help support the channel is just to hit that like button. Now we're going to start off today's great deals with a game making a first ever appearance on the series and that is What Remains of Edith Finch that is now 70% off dropping its price to only $5.99 and will be running till May 31st. Now this is a game that I'm super happy is finally on a heavy discount because I originally played through the game and it is ultimately a walking simulator. By that, what I mean is don't expect any actions or quick maneuvers here. All you have to do is make your way through the story to really get delivered an incredible narrative. And on that end, at least, if you're into those type of games, this one will not disappoint because the story is delivered in a fantastic manner. It does, however, get quite creepy at moments, however, because you are living through the last moments of all the different members of a particular family. In the game, you're exploring through a house and as you unlock each new room, you live through the last day of the family member that occupied it. Now, there are some really deep moments and also some very touching ones. So if you're into the visual novel genre or walking simulators, this is one that you really have to pick up, especially right now at only $5.99. Now, our next game on today's list is one we actually haven't seen in quite a while, and that is Battle Chasers Night War. That is back to 70% off, dropping its price to only $11.99. You will have to move quickly, however, because this one is ending on May 27th. Now this game is basically a turn-based RPG. And you know what? Among some of the best RPGs on the Nintendo Switch, I really think Battle Chasers should not be ignored. It has a really great storyline, some completely amazing visuals, and a very engaging battle system. Personally, this is one of those games that I really don't get why it didn't eventually get a sequel, because it was crying out for one. And a lot of people don't even know that it's actually based off of a 90s comic book series. Another really interesting point about this game is that there's a huge amount of replayability here because even if you already know the storyline, each time you replay the game, the dungeons are randomly generated. Overall, if you're a fan of RPGs, especially turn-based ones, this is a game that you just have to pick up and at $11.99, it is an amazing deal. Now, our next game for today is yet again a brand new one to the series, and that is Alder's Blood. That is now 70% off, dropping it to its lowest ever price of $5.99, and this one will be running all the way till June 12th. Now, this time around, rather than a traditional turn-based RPG, we're rather looking at a strategy RPG. It's also one with a quite unique combat system, one that revolves a lot around stealth. Right away when I think about this game, what comes to mind, at least mechanically, is the XCOM series. However, when we look at the visuals and art style, that just screams out Darkest Dungeons with a Lovecraftian Western-inspired design. I do want to warn, however, that this game for a strategy RPG is extremely challenging. And it does have quite a few moving parts, like its generational upgrade system that will take quite a while to wrap your head around. However, if you're into really challenging strategy gameplay with a far out there art style, then this one at $5.99 is an easy suggestion for this week. Now, our next game for today is yet again a brand new one to the series, and that is Trigger Witch, that is now 35% off, dropping its price to $9.74, and will be running till June 3rd. Now in this game we're looking at a twin stick shooter that mixes in adventure and exploration. I mean a very quick reference point would be imagine The Legend of Zelda however done as a twin stick shooter. And I've got to say that Trigger Witch actually marries those elements quite well. 
It also mixes a quite unique battle system that does a super good job of making you use all your different weapons. Because although you have unlimited ammo, there is a cooldown on each one of your weapons when you expand a clip, and therefore you have no choice but to switch to something else. And it also has a great 16-bit art style with great use of colors and one that will remind you once again a lot of something like A Link to the Past. And even though it might be close to that $10 mark, with a game that offers more than 8 hours of gameplay, I would say this is another amazing pickup for this week. So now it's time to take a quick break and announce today's winners of the $5 eShop gift cards. And our first winner for today will be Helvin John Carabeo, who said, awesome pick of the week, Scott Pilgrim. And you know what, Helvin? I do agree, Scott Pilgrim is an amazing pick. And when you can get that game at under $5, it's actually just unbelievable. And our second winner for today is going to be Anthony Wade, who said, Dungeons and Puzzles looks fun. And yet again, Anthony, I would definitely agree with you that if you are into puzzle games, Dungeons & Puzzles is actually a very strong one that I played recently on the Nintendo Switch. And once again, at under $5, definitely worth a pickup. So now all you need to do to claim your $5 eShop gift cards is reach out to me in my pinned comment down below in this video. So now if we jump straight back into our deals, we have a huge one making a first appearance because it's pretty much one of the first major sales, and that is LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga that is now 20% off $47.99 for the regular edition and $55.99 for the deluxe edition and will be running till June 6th. Now first of all, this is a game I actually played on stream and if you want to take a look, I'll be linking that down below. Now we do have a lot of LEGO games on the Nintendo Switch and this is definitely by far the most expensive one. However, it is also the biggest one. And when we're talking about the Skywalker Saga, this actually covers all 9 episodes of the current movie franchise. Now just in case you don't actually know what the idea behind these LEGO games are, they are basically 3D puzzle platformers where you control different characters from these huge franchises and make your way through the different storylines, all the while done in a great humoristic style featuring LEGOs. What I've played so so far is quite amazing and it's graphically probably one of the best LEGO games on the Nintendo Switch. Also, just before going, I do want to warn that you can actually pick this game up physically on discount for about the same price. So if you're into physical media, you can always keep an eye out for that. Now next on today's list, we have a returning favorite of mine, however one that's at a brand new lowest ever price, and that is Wallachia Reign of Dracula that is now 60% off, dropping its price to $5.99 and will be running all the way till June 13th. Now this game is a 2D styled retro action platformer. And as you can see, both by probably the visuals and also the title, it is heavily inspired by the Castlevania series. However, I've got to say that this game does a lot to make it its own. Number one, your basic weapon is a bow and arrow rather than your traditional whip. Also, it really features its own cast of environments and enemies alike. One thing, however, that does carry over from the classic Castlevania series is that level of challenge. So this is a slight warning. This is a very difficult to the action platformer. So before picking that up, make sure you're ready for that. But if you are at only $5.99, this is a great pickup for this week. Now next, we have another returning favorite of mine, and that is Tanuki Justice. That is also 60% off, dropping it to $5.99 and running all the way till June 13th. And on top of it, this game will be my pick of the week. Now yet again, this is actually a game that I played fully on stream. And it is actually currently one of my favorite games on the Nintendo Switch. It is basically the combination of a 2D action platformer with bullet hell type of gameplay. And by the title, once again, you can probably tell, but you're playing as a cute little tanuki. Now don't be fooled, however, by the cute retro presentation. This is yet again a very challenging game. And although the game is only six levels long, it'll probably take you hours and hours of dedication to make your way through them. Now I don't know if it's the simple yet addictive gameplay or the just fantastic retro graphical presentation, but overall I just can't put this game down and easily play it on a weekly basis. So if you're in for a challenge and you don't know what to pick up for this week, you know what, give this one a try. Now the next game on our list is another one that's hit a brand new low price and that is Golden Force that is also 60% off 
dropping its price to $7.99 and once again running till June 13th. Now this is yet again another 2D action platformer, however I would say with a slightly more traditional type of gameplay. Traditional, but yet again challenging. So once again, if you're picking up this game for this week, just be forewarned, it will take quite a few tries before finishing the game. However, if you do put the time in, this is another one of those games that will be very rewarding. On top of it, it yet again features some great retro style visuals with some completely immense and fun bosses. On top of it, this game features four different playable characters and also a co-op mode. And I would say that the best way to play this game actually is in co-op. So yet again for this week, if you're looking for a great game to pick up and you don't have Golden Force yet, it's another easy suggestion. Now yet again, we have a brand new entry to the series with Lost in Random that is now back to 50% off, dropping its price to $14.99 and this one will be running till May 30th. I would say that primarily Lost and Random plays out as a 3D action platformer. However, it has a very original combat system that also brings in some card based mechanics. There's also a huge RNG element to the gameplay because it also mixes in dice rolls. Now, if all of this seems quite confusing, don't worry, after playing the game for a few minutes, it'll all come together quite nicely. On top of it, visually, this game is just stunning, with some visuals that are clearly inspired by Tim Burton classics like A Nightmare Before Christmas. I'll also say that although the storyline is quite simple and straightforward, it's actually very well delivered throughout the game, and for me at least, was very engaging. Overall, I really think this game has a lot to offer for anyone with any interest in 3D action platformers or just games with amazingly original visual presentations. And yet again, at 50% off for $14.99, it's another great pickup. So now it's time for this week's sizzle reel of deals with a ton of other great games to consider.
So we're pretty much at the end of another eShop deals video. And although the video is a day late, you know what? I think we had a great list come together. So now let me know what games you're picking up for this week in the comments down below. Also, just as usual, I really want to take a couple of seconds to thank my channel supporters. Their monthly support is so important for the channel and I appreciate it a ton. And don't forget on the way out that if you did like the video, consider hitting that like button, subscribing to the channel if you aren't already and clicking on the notification bell so you know when all my future videos come out. And as usual, I hope I'll see you in my next video.